Welcome back, tennis fans. Another GTL news, and this one all about Alex Zverev. As we know, he did suffer a very nasty injury in the semi-final of Roland Garros against Rafael Nadal. And we have had some recent news from him uh, explaining the extent of the injury and how long he's going to be out for. So this is what Zverev had to say. Uh, hey guys, I am now on my way back home. Based on the first medical checks, it looks like I have torn several lateral ligaments in my right foot. I'll be flying to Germany on Monday to make further examinations and to determine the best and quickest way for me to recover. I want to thank everyone all over the world for the kind messages that I've received since yesterday. Your support means a lot to me right now. And many thanks to my friends from Goodwill Private Aviation for taking such good care of me in the given circumstances. I will try and keep you updated as much as possible on further developments. See you next time, Roland Garros. And it was a great Roland Garros for him, defeating Carlos Alcaraz. He looked extremely good against Rafael Nadal. And you never know, the way he was playing, he could have won that match, maybe. Um, and then everything would have been different for Rafa at Roland Garros. Um, but it didn't happen like that. He did suffer a very nasty injury, and it appears to be several lateral ligaments in his right foot. Um, so it's no serious break. However, it's still going to be a lengthy time on the sidelines for Sasha Zverev. You wouldn't expect him to be playing Wimbledon. And we certainly know he is not playing in Halle either um, because he's announced that as well uh, today. So this is just an image he posted on his Instagram, I believe, just saying the treatment had started with a few of his dogs there. You can see it's very heavily braced up at the moment, the right foot. Um, and here we go. Alex Verev withdraws from the Halle Open. Of course, you did not expect him to be playing that. And the last thing here is uh, this is how the ATP rankings uh, would be next week. So Medvedev is going to be world number one. Um, and number two actually is going to be Sasha Zverev. You can see that here. Um, he's not going to obviously be able to become world number one now. So that was his big dream, which has been shattered due to the injury with him being sidelined for a few months. But Novak Djokovic drops to third. And you can see, well, uh, Rafael Nadal slowly stalking the pack there in fourth. And he's approaching Novak very quickly. And Kasper Ruud in the top five. But yeah, just a quick roundup there for Sasha Zverev. Not the best news, but it could have been a lot worse. Uh, hopefully we see him very soon because it would be a shame if he misses all of the grass court swing. But it does look extremely likely. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. If you haven't already, hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you very soon.